pockets. I'm completely stuck. Nothing I can do to break out of this. What is that? Ah! Nope. Nope. If I'm walking into ah! Guys, you've probably seen some kind of crazy intro by this point that I put at the start. Man, I've been sitting here for a few minutes, literally debating how am I going to manage playing this game again? And the conclusion? I'm not. I'm really not. Yeah, we're back. It's the Nun Massacre. Yeah, great. So what is going on, guys? This is Ryan here, and welcome back to the Nun Massacre. You guys really enjoyed the last episode, didn't you? Yeah, this game is literally my kryptonite at this point when it comes to horror games. I'm not sure why. I think it's a cross between definitely the style they've gone for and just also the way that the music and sound has worked in this game. Absolutely terrifying. Like, so guys, it's the Nun Massacre. We're going to get straight into this thing because I'm crapping my pants already, okay? Play intro, skip ahead. We're playing the intro again, man. I need some chill before the absolute disaster. Now, I never opened any of these doors whilst I was here. What the freak? Where are we? Hold up. Open the door a bit more. I don't need to go in here. Bro, that's the clown. Right, that we've- Wait, what? Hold up, let me open this door. That one's locked up, and there's no way to open that. I'm trying to open all these drawers a second. See, this is something we didn't do. There's nothing here. Bro, can I, like, look out there? No, I can't break the game, dang it. Can I, like, lean into here a bit? I can't. Oh, I kind of want to go in there, you see? That's the clown, though, that the girl speaks about. So, why do we have it? Let's get the no. Let's get this done. I need this moment right now, guys, before we do anything too crazy. I just need to breathe, all right? Yeah, man, you guys really enjoyed the last episode, and I guess I enjoy playing as well. Think about Puppet Combo as well. They force you to be so engrossed within the game. There are so many things happening, and just the way that horror is portrayed, bro, it's a nightmare. It's a nightmare. Can I mountain go up here, by the way? Dang it, I can't. All right, now, there's a few things whilst I was walking around that I swear I saw. There's some, like, weird things. Look how close we was to whatever that was. Do I want to jump with? Whoever that was jumped off the edge. But I ain't gonna follow suit. Just mount and go your way back up because we know we can do that. What? Did this happen last time? The Nun Massacre. Like a little loading screen. I don't think I remember seeing this. But we've actually got music playing this time too. A good job of setting the atmosphere. Music by that dude. What is that up there? There's like all these new random things I think. I'm not sure if it's because maybe we're playing it a second time, so it, like, updates a little bit. Guess we'll have to find out. Written by Leela Amirati and Edward W. Hey, yeah, good writing job, guys. Kind of jacked up there, but I don't say so myself. What is that? Bro. What the heck is going on? It's like things have literally changed this time. There was something going I'm literally getting fuzzes right now. I don't understand. Someone literally jumped. There's something there, you see? Oh, do I mount and go down right now to see what's on that level? I don't know. I am so confused. I'm getting shivers again. Oh my god. Hang on a sec. Look at this. I'm gonna stay zoomed in. That's a person right there, you see? Look at that. Bro. Oh my god. Why is this... I've never had a game do this to me. Like, literally, guys, my eyes, again, are freaking out. Thunderclap exactly when it needed to happen. Guys, we're back. Thought I'd skip through then to once we got back to the school. Because this is where the horror really lies. Behind these walls. And so we meet again. Oh, boy. Go ahead, finish opening this thing up. I know once I go through there, the nightmare begins all over again. Willingly for myself as well, you know. Go ahead and get this thing started. Reluctantly. <laughs> Turns the VHS effect back on. Look, get the freak off my screen right now. Guys, now this time round as well when we play, I figured I'm going to adopt a different style, okay? When it comes to puppet combo horror stuff, I got to be more chill, more focused on what's going on. So we're going to take it a little bit more chill with the commentary and just try and get things working as best we can, as fast as we can. So with that said, let's get started, you know? Need to find the room where the light source is. That's with the letter to find ourselves the flashlight. I think it's in this room here. So, can I see what I'm doing, please? Push that open. Should be in here, I think. There we go. Take the lighter. Just on cue. All right, it's a good start. But 
there's some curious stuff I wanted to pick up on before we get too far in because there's some lore with this game. The note at the top here. So let's take a look at this part where it says today we learned about Saint Lucy. Her eyes were put on a plate and she became a martyr. That's a weird word. Sister Euphemia said that her love for God saved her from the evil Romans that tried to hurt her. So let's talk about this Saint Lucy. Her eyes were put on a plate. If you look at the nun's face, she's got like black streaming lines coming down. It's like she was wearing some kind of eyeliner or something, or maybe the blood around her eyes just dried up. Nasty thought, but the truth. Guys, I didn't make this game up, okay? Puppet Combo did, so you can blame them. Let's check down here at the very end. Okay, 2B. This one opens. Hold up. Did I ever go this way here? I can't even remember. Open these two. Two more just here as well. Nothing. Two possible hiding spots. So I wonder... What the freak was that? Hold up. Did I drop... I dropped the lighter. My god. And you end up creating your own horror experience with this nightmare. My gosh. Okay, so 2F. Let's open this up. Toilet stalls. We've definitely been here. Yeah, we have. I recall. What? Above? I don't know. So, we've got the wooden plank. <sighs> Guys, I'm terrified already. Like, I can't even describe the sensations I get when I play this game. And like, I saw the comments as well. Some of you guys feeling the same thing. This game is the definition of horror, okay? Yes! So we'll place that there. Just cross this thing. And the nightmare begins truly. Yeah. Three. ID. Open the door. No, wait, wait. So the kid. We saw like a kid run before around here somewhere, I think. Just checking these cupboards. Another rock. Wait, hold up. That's boarded up, so... I think that was my own footsteps. Guys, I'm so- <gasps> I gotta hide, man. This game just does something to me. I don't understand. I've never had a game do this. I'm gonna do this again manually, okay? No editing. What is wrong with me? How can she just creep like that? inside of a room and make no sound. I don't get it. Wait, hold up a second, wait. She didn't see me. Hold on, I gotta hide for this one. Is the nun blind? Is that why sometimes when you go near her, she can't see you? And it takes a while before she recognizes you're there. That would make so much sense, you know what I mean? With the eyes missing and stuff. So she relies solely on sound. That's creepy as freak and jacked up. I mean, with the knowledge that she relies on sound. So get the freak back out of here, all right? Ha Just wait a second. Gotta figure this out. Guys, I've been sitting pretty for about four and a half seconds. I'm done waiting. What the freak was that? Uh, wait. Is that the... That was her blade sticking out right there. Let me see what she does. Stop opening doors. She's looming so close. This is intense. So she's gone that way. Right, hop through. Hop through. I don't know if she can climb through here. I'm just gonna assume she can't. Open those. The note again there. Bro, I ain't got no time to read no notes, but we'll take this. The radar. What does this tell us? Because I've used it before, and it doesn't seem to let me know when the nun's close. For something. I have no idea. Right, you know what? Skip this crap. I'm in the vents. See you later. Don't you dare tell me she's in the vents with me. The static is intense. I don't know where she is, but I'm nervous as freak. Okay, sound's going down. Let's descend down a little bit. Hold up. What can we find down here? Been here many times, so we've got the vent covered there. This way... I think this is where the fan blade is. Around these corners here. Yeah, so we need... Oh, what do we need again? We need to cut the power upstairs, so we need the wire cutters. Now, some of you guys were telling me as well, when we actually get to that room, and I said that I was... Why did you choose to swap weapons as the thunder claps so hard? So anyway, guys, I think some of you were saying that in the room we was in, the doors have little locks that you can spin. I just wasn't looking careful enough. So that was my bad entirely. Let's try and progress back to that point, though, if we could even get there again. It'll be real, guys. My butt cheeks are clenched so hard. I, I don't really know. I really don't. We're back on the blood splattered floor. So let me go on the low. Gotta really take this easy. She's not down there. The thing is, she like looms in these sometimes, you know? Like waiting for you or something. It's so jacked up. Up another floor. That corner's clear. Well, I think anyway. Look at the discoloration to the floor here. You gotta be so forceful. Like, you gotta throw them doors open. On this floor here. Let's see. That's where the gate is. And that's where we need the wire cutters for. So, the mission, find the wire cutters. She's not this way either. Okay, I'm push this thing. This is the bathroom. Now, there is something down here. Paper clip. I'm not sure what they're for. We need to... It's just a towel trap or something. Nothing in there. Other than, you know, jacked up bed. Go back out. You gotta check every single corner, like checking your six every two seconds. All right, man, we got one way back. Now, I'm gonna try and peek a little bit as I go around the corners. Maybe that'll help, or at least give me some confidence. Ignore the sound. 
That's designed to freak you out. But cheeks clenched so tight. I haven't seen the nun for a long time, too. Give me here. Don't be me here. <sighs> okay, so this is the solution to get into the vent. I think this was the solution last time, which got us to the other room. So hop up. Let's go. All right, progress. This is the light room. And that's with the door that had something behind it. The wire cutters, then they're always here. So we can go ahead and take these. Don't be so confident when we go back down. I don't know where this lady's roaming right now. What the freak she's even doing? Hey, lady, you there? Ah, uh, even if you are, I don't want none to do with you. <clears throat> and guys, even in these moments, okay, where you're waiting to try and figure out the best next move to do, the ambience is just so piercing through the air that it makes you feel so distracted that like you can't physically concentrate. The terror is just unprecedented, man. And you know what? I can't wait to experience more puppet combo horror games. I the thunder have to clap right there. I'm getting shivers right now. Close the metal door behind us. All right, now let's just get this done. All right, we know what to do here. There you go. Progress. Don't wait. Let's get going. This sucks. This is so painful. Do I hear her? I'm not sure. Check this way. How do I get back to that room? I gotta find a vent or something, and then we can pretty much go from there. Here, here, here. Oh, baby. Yeah, let's go. Woo! Huh? She can't be in the vents. She can't be in the vents. No way. Or can she? I, I, guys, I, I'm so scared. Like, I'm gonna leave in the silences in between. What the freak? She can't be in here looming around, right? Only if you're being chased, then she'd have a reason to go in. I, I, I don't know, though. I, I don't know. We're gonna climb through, though. This is good progression, right? We've already made it this far, and it's been a fraction of the time. She hasn't even been here yet. We've got those stakes with the mannequin parts on. Let me see if there's a use for them in this room, because when I was editing, I saw this here. Talking about seven offerings of flesh to Christ. Now, these mannequin arms and stuff, could that be the offering? Okay, so steal the forearm. Is she nearby? <laughs> that was the nun's arm right there. I was about to get mad. Throw it in this game. Dude, it weighed it down. So we need seven. How many is on the stakes right there? Three more. So that's four. We need to find another three that will be scattered around somewhere. The question is where? Okay, bro, check the door. I guess that little ping is a good sign. And listen, I don't think the scale's sentient enough to understand what's real and what's not. I'd be offering up like the wire cutters by this point, like take my flashlight. Just weigh the thing down, but my guess is this thing goes a little bit further than just being able to do that. Because we know this universe is messed up, man. We saw the nun when we was at this place last time, like teleporting around. So I think she's literally a martyr and she has the ability to move like that. We open this door. That little kid is gonna run, right? Nope. The little kid wasn't here this time. Open some of these. You know, I haven't even seen the nun really. Saw her a few times before, but it's been death. Oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god. This was the room that freaked me the freak out, though. Freaking, freaking, freak. I'm gonna check these really, really fast. There's nothing there. And check the whole room as a whole. Wait, what? English ability is just gone right now. I really struggle with this game to focus on commentary and also playing. So let's just do one. Go ahead and swipe this. Listen, if the nun came near me personally, I'd drop the hammer straight on her forehead. Now let's check these doors a little bit, okay? What? Dude. There is locks all over the door, so open this up. Where are we? Like another staircase here? And it goes one way! So this is a totally new part of the building, I think? Okay, before we leave this... Let me see. Do I see the nun? Okay, no, we're still good, dude. I gotta be so careful. Two locks here. Still locked up even still. Wait, no, it's not. Outside? Ooh, the courtyard. Some kind of statue here. It's been decapitated, that it has. I mean, we've got all these gravestones here too. That's it out here. So who was digging this? Because the nun is blind, I think? We go under that is the idea. What else can she really see? Back inside. Come back outside. You hear how the sound does that? No, I hate that. Close again. There's nothing on that door there, but this one. There is another one of the locks, so open that. Push the door. Where the freak is this? Is this another? It's another new part. Look. Oh my gosh. Oh my god! Wait, where is she? Where is she? Ah! Right in my face! Run! Okay, keep going, keep going. Up the stairs, up the stairs. Come on, keep going. In here, in here. Dude, this is bad, this is bad. I have a headache. It's a new part of the school with new items and new stuff like that. I hate the nun so much. It is one of the scariest characters in any game I've played. I'm gonna lose my voice so quick. What do we have in here? It's a screwdriver. That's for the, uh, the vent thing, right? So I don't need this. Take the screwdriver. Now, do I try and get back in the ventilation part, maybe? I'm not sure. Right. Nothing else in there. This room seems kind of barren other than that. I'm trying to be as quick as I can. Okay, no none there. What's this down on the floor there? I think that one. What is this? Videotape. My inventory is full, though. I can't really afford to drop anything to go watch some, like, you know, home video. Here, here, here. You see? Okay, so over to the screwdriver. Let's go. 
Use that thing. Yes! Progressing in this game feels incredible, though. You know, what isn't very incredible, though, is that uh, kind of how dark it is in here. So let's get this done nice and quick. Or just down there. And that gives us access. It just drops away. I don't even care where the freak that thing goes. Pride before... Uh, I don't know what you're talking about, but sure thing. So what is this? A new path. Events. It goes everywhere. Let's go in a straight line so we don't get lost for now, I suppose. Wait. This don't feel right. I feel like we'll just end up getting lost this way here. Pride goeth before destruction and a heart spurt before a fall. What are you trying to say? Something wrong with this place here? Does like something bad happen if we go this way? I don't like this. Hold on, what's this way here? I see I don't like it, but there's a place we can- <laughs> What is happening? Is that like a dead end? If I fall down there, I'm stuck forever? Yeah, we ain't going down there. I'll go a little bit further this way here. Not for much longer though. It's so weird, this whole situation. Like, is this leading me anywhere? It is. What the heck? I'm in like the loft. It's a TV up here. What is this? We'll open all these. I mean, I don't see the nun getting up here anytime soon. And how this thing's got power, like, teach me? <laughs> oh my god! Oh! How can I just game over so quick? Literally completely speechless because it's so hard to progress. That was 35 minutes of gameplay for that. It ends literally in the blink of an eye. Don't focus on it. Don't focus on it. Guys, I made progress back to this same point again. Oh boy, look, all I'm gonna be doing here right now is just checking around a little bit more than last time, okay? Because we didn't get to see, I think, what was over the other side. So we'll do that. But I'm at least going to take the hammer. The freak is in here, I think. So we'll take that. None. Don't do this, okay? I really don't want anything to do with any of your business right now. Open this. Now, this is the side we didn't check out. Am I correct? I feel like, yeah, this is it. This leads up a big way here. Yeah, look at this part of the building. It's all like clinical, it almost feels like. Disgustingly clinical, I might add. But in here, what is this? It's like illuminated. Wait, wait, hold up. So, is it like, it's different flank routes around the place, that's all it is. Wait, I got the hammer. The hammer is for this, right? So, dude, you gotta paint it. You gotta remove every single one. That is so cruel. Check your six every time. Can she hear that? Oh my god. Oh my god. I'm not even gonna look. You know, if she's gonna hear this, whatever, I don't care. I don't even care about beating this right now, dude. I just literally wanna open this thing. One last now. Don't even think about it. There you go. Yeah, don't even think about the lightning. Good job. Nice. Okay, what is this? Close. Close, close, close. I'm, I'm not really feeling a bath, but uh, thanks, I guess. Wait, drain cleaner? Can't carry any more items. What the freak do I want this for? Hold up. Get rid of those and take the drain cleaner? Drain cleaner. Why is that so important? It was hidden behind literally that door there. Hmm. Well, I guess we know at least going back through this way, we can get into the vents. So I guess we'll at least do this. But drain cleaner. Ignore it. Nothing to do with you. That's their problem, not yours, or something like that. I don't understand. This game is too jacked up for my taste. It really is. Nope. If I'm walking into a- ah! Oh, just run! Keep running, bro. I don't know where I'm going. I don't care. I don't care. I hate this game so much. Literally, I hate this game so much. Bro, don't, don't, don't do this. I can't do this, man. It's like fuzzing when I'm in the vents. If she's seriously in here, I'm gonna literally give myself up. I'm over this. All right, guys. I've actually progressed back to the same point. This is like 65 minutes later, but this time I'm gonna commit to this like weird thing, the way this ventilation system is. There's gotta be something else in here that we can find, you know? Can't accept that this is just endless vents and that's it. And that probably would be the easiest thing to do, I'm being honest. This, this goes on forever and it keeps going. The heck is back here, you know? Who even implemented this? Like, what? Is there ever gonna be an e I'm actually concerned. Is this really happening? It's still going. Look at this. It just continues on. We've actually reached a bend, so we've made progress. And it still continues to keep going. Something there. 
What is that? It's like glistening so much. Someone put something all the way back here. Videotape. Can't carry any more items. I kind of need the stuff I got though. I'll have to come back for it. For now, I'm gonna keep on keeping. What is more further in this direction here, if anything at all? What? What is... What the freak is happening? It's like our ears are ringing out. Wait, the vent's getting all destroyed. Look at this. What is even back? Wait, back up? I'm stuck. Yeah, I can't move. Am I like panicking? Like, look at this. I'm completely stuck. Nothing I can do to break out of this. I am literally freaking out. What is that? <laughs> and it just closed my game down. My progress is gone again? I hit my wall, I can't go no further back. We're done here.